Hey, good morning guys, Brian here, Brian's Law and Maintenance. Hey, hope you guys are having a good morning. It is actually Monday morning, probably about 9, 9.30 in the morning. Uh, I have a really late day today, just the commercial property and then a couple trailer park lawns. So a little bit different pace, got to sleep in a little bit, feels good, man. Uh, but I do have a question for you guys. Uh, sometimes I like to use our YouTube channel as like a resource to learn the business. All the time I use you guys to learn the business. You guys have so much information out there. Uh, so many of you have been there, done that, been in business for so long so one issue that I'm coming up with and I'll try to walk backwards uh, it's really bright this morning of course it's pure Sun uh, but my trailer is getting completely scratched up uh, I'm not sure if you guys can make it out but uh, microscopically there is like 2,000 scrapes you guys know what I'm saying well like make, make 50 maybe but there's like 50 scrapes all on the side of the trailer I'm not sure if you guys can see all these it's really tough you know with the, the bright Sun uh, you know, not complaining or anything like that. I know it would happen, uh, but along the upper two feet of the trailer, there are tons of scrapes from all the trees and the uh, subdivisions that we're in along the boulevard. And it's just the, the nature of the beast with our types of subs. Uh, but I was curious what you guys use to like buff stuff out like that on a utility trailer. Is there any solution or any brand of product that you guys can recommend? Um, maybe I can do a before and after video for you guys and help out the community and this can be a resource uh, But if you guys have just a quick second like maybe if you guys have like an armor all product or like a turtle wax product I, I really don't know nothing's promoted here. I'm just curious what you guys uh, You know uh, mo is here with trying to get all these scrapes. Do you guys buff them out like once a month? How do you guys do it? Do you just do that in the off season? Um, I tell my guys when we pull the trailer around the sub to stay a little bit more into the lane that way we're not getting uh, all those scrapes in the uh, from the branches and that's also another reason why I was kind of hanging off doing the uh, vinyl wrapping uh, and lettering because I didn't want it to get all scraped and that it plus it also costs like a thousand bucks which I'm not putting money towards that right now I want to put money towards other places so anyway um, curious what you guys do for the scrapes man I, I, I swear to god I got probably like 50 uh, of them some of them were actually <laughs> kind of gouged in a little bit uh, I don't think the actual like paint or fiberglass or whatever it is the shell is really damaged uh, there's just a lot of like hard branches that probably just scrape across so anyway leave me a comment down below love to hear what you guys are using or if you if you don't do it you just say hey screw it just let it go that's just what you do with you uh, enclosed trailers hey I'm still learning every single day but maybe some of you guys can learn as well what some of the pros are using by reading the comments um, let me know all right guys that's pretty much it just short and sweet wanted to kind of uh, pull the audience on this one all right uh, thanks so much for watching shoot a big thumbs up if you guys can and uh, if you're new don't forget to hit that subscribe button all right guys we'll catch up with you soon have a great week bye bye